Good morning, Mass Bomb staff and students. This is Mr. Lyon with your Monday A-Day announcements. And we got a lot going on, so I am coming in hotter than the sun today. Upcoming events on the 25th of this month. We have no school because of Yom Kippur. That same week, Thursday the 28th, is back to school night, students. Friday the 29th is a double shot. First, we have the senior family breakfast that morning. And that afternoon, students, you have a half day. And students, as you know, are number one. Priority as educators at Mass Bomb is to keep you safe and healthy so that you can learn. That means reach out to a staff member that you trust. If you have concerns or problems, we are here to support you. All right. We already know that the fall sports season has begun. Please turn in your PIAA physical and trip slips to Coach Calamag in room 308 ASAP. We have a football meeting after school today. All right. For the football rebuild. We need 10 or more players with PIAA physicals. We have a lot of students that have expressed interest, have shown up to meetings. We need the physicals at this point. Okay, they can be obtained at City Life Health. See Coach Calamag if you have any questions. Soccer! There will be a meeting Monday, September 11th and 310 for those interested in girls soccer. Okay, needed five or more players with PIAA physicals. Again. You can get free physicals at City Life, uh, City Life Health. The first game is this Thursday, September the 14th. And boys soccer, good luck to the Mass Bomb boys soccer team because they will be dismissed after the conclusion of seventh period today to meet Coach Rizzo in front of the 122 gym. The Mass Bomb Panthers will take on SLA Bieber in the first boys soccer game since 2019. Go get them! All right. Cheerleading tryouts with Nurse Chris. Attention all students. Cheerleading tryouts will be held this week on Wednesday, September 13th, and Thursday, September 14th. Both days will be from 240 to 340 in the 300 gym. Students interested must attend both days and must be on time. All students trying out need to have a PIAA physical completed by their doctor. Stop by through 208 with any questions. All right, for Mr. Thomas. Junior Valdez claims he won every chess match he played this summer. Hmm. Mr. Thomas commented, if you're not losing any games, then you're not playing against the kind of talent that will lead to improving your game. And then proceeded to be the kind of talent that will lead to Junior's improvement. All right. Good job, Mr. Thomas. At all serious players, see Mr. Thomas in room 407 for a parent permission slip so that Mass Mom can compete versus other high schools in the interscholastic league this year. We know Junior was shouted out and celebrated in the newspaper for his work at McPherson Square Library. When I asked Miss, uh, when I asked Junior what he does there, he said, mostly I just, this is his quote, mostly I just roast young bulls in chess. Junior, I mean, it's time to step up the competition. We're going to have a quote towards the end of the announcements that Junior, you are the inspiration for. Continuing. Mass Bomb Robotics Team with Miss Higgins. Interested in battle bot type robots? I am. Are you an electrician, welder, carpenter, graphic designer, sports marketer, auto mechanic, videographer, or photographer? Do you love math, public speaking, teaching others, fundraising? Or fundraising? Mass Bomb's first ever robotics team needs you. Come showcase your talent against Central, Northeast, and Lincoln. Come show the suburban schools that we are the best. If you are interested, please see Miss Higgins in 616 ASAP. There is limited space. And Miss Higgins, for me, can somebody on the team please build a Mecha Godzilla battle bot? That's what I want. Simple request, I think. Dean's office reminders for Mr. Trainer. We're going to go quick on these because we have a lot going on, but these are very important items, okay? Thank you, Dean Trainer. Mass Mom IDs, they must be worn around your neck at all times. First ID is free, okay? Any IDs after that cost $5. If you don't scan in in the morning with your ID, that is a $1 fine every day, okay? So let's make sure that we are about that business. Uniform is required every single day at Mass Bomb. We're off to a not bad start, but it could be better with uniforms. No uniforms equals a consequence. If you need help, we are available to help. Uh, please see Mr. Trainer in the dean's office. All right. 
Continuing, hall sweeps. You know, students, we do, uh, I guess it's four hall sweeps a day. All right, there should be no reason you are ever in a hall sweep, but if you are caught in a hall sweep, that will result in a demerit or larger consequence. So students, keep that in mind. Amnesty box, the worry-free amnesty box. It's located in the marble hallway right inside the main entrance. If you have items that are contraband and you forgot that you had it on you and you want to discard it, you can do so in the amnesty box. No questions asked. Please see any SSO for further information. School safety officer. And lockers. Students are assigned their lockers by their advisor, and they are recommended to use your assigned, assigned locker for storing personal items throughout the school day. You may not use someone else. Uh, someone else's locker. If you have questions on your locker, see your advisor, Mr. Diggs, or Mr. Trainer. And reminder of the off limits areas at Mass Bomb. Students, reminder about Cooth, the free, safe, and confidential mental health and well being support available to all students. Students, that's our effort checklist. We know, students, those are some of the items that the effort checklist PBS points can purchase. The Mass Bomb Student Success Center. All right, what is it? Well, we're going to talk about that. The SSC is going to open for the year on Monday, September the 18th. It's going to be located in the library and will be open every day of the week, before school, during school, and after school. It is your space, your community space, students. Okay, so it's going to be open daily from 7 to 7.30 a.m., will be open during all lunch periods. And as you know, the library is right next to the lunchroom. So if you want to spend some nice, quiet, productive time in the library, as opposed to the lunchroom, you can certainly do so. Every day is going to have its own unique theme. Monday is going to be the counseling and step support day. If you want to see a counselor in there, Dr. Hayward, they will be on. You can always see them, but they will be in the SSC during those days on Monday. Academic support and PBS Paul Mart will be on Tuesdays. Wednesday will be the College and Career Awareness Day. For example, you'll be able to get working papers from Mr. Jacobs in the SSC on those days. Thursday is Clubs and Athletics Day and also a PBS Paul Mart Day. So Paul Mart is open Tuesdays and Thursdays. That's where you can spend your points in the SSC. And Friday will just be an open house. It will be open for all. And it will be open, the SSC, after school daily from 2.34 to 4 p.m. Students' reminder about Chromebook repairs, social media. All right. Do you have something, staff or students, for the Mass Mom social media for our award-winning Instagram? Email Mrs. Linscombe at slinscombe at philasd.org. The staff and student. Shout outs. We have three today. First, from Ms. Worthman. I would like a shout out to be included in Wednesday's or Thursday's announcement. Sorry, Ms. Worthman, we got to it on Monday. For Mr. Constance and student Leah Santiago for repairing the 607 rear door. It is appreciated. All right, great job. Leah and Mr. Constance, thank you, Ms. Worthman, for that shout out. For Mr. Wexler, I want to shout out my advisory students, Jalen Young, Shadir Yates, David White. Keenan Waters, Sasha Wallace, Amir Wooten, and Salim West for coming to advisory and starting off the year strong. Great job, students. Thank you, Mr. Wexler. And Ms. Walker, I'd like to shout out Raheem Jamison. Thank you for volunteering to pass out the work on day one. That's great. Very responsible of you and extra PBIS points coming your way. Today, we're going to and was something a little different. Last few years, we did the um, days of the week. Okay, maybe we'll still do that in some form. But I mean, how many times can you hear that it's like national like cheese pizza day or whatever? Um, we're going to do the quote of the week. And Junior, you are the inspiration for this. It is from a Nobel Prize winning mathematician and physicist named Frank Wilzek. I always loved this one. I always remembered it. I actually saved this graphic in my phone, and I look at it from time to time. He said, if you don't make mistakes, you're not working on hard enough problems. And that's a big mistake. All right.
students, what is the literary term that was used there by Frank Wilczek? What is that literary term? Anybody that can tell me at dllon at philasd.org will win a prize from Mr. Lon's office. Finally, staff and students, you know who we are? You know what our vision is? We're Mass Bomb. We build the future. Have a great Monday.